in 2013, uh, Tracy Chu decided that she was going to ask, where are the women? And she made a Medium post that asked just that. And then she started tracking that. And that's how we got our first detection of what was going on in the uh, tech industry. And shortly after she did that, um, tech companies started releasing diversity reports uh, that came in 2014. And we started to see that we had some really poor outcomes in the industry. Uh, there was no representation, well, little. Like, across the board, you saw 2%, 3% representation of black people, 1% to 2% representation of Latinx people, um, roughly 20 to 30% representation of women. And, like, that doesn't reflect the world we live in at all. And so, pretty indicative of a problem. So what went wrong uh, in our work on diversity and inclusion? We have failed to define what a good outcome looks like. We have been doing so much work, working, 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 but nobody said, this is what we're working toward. This is what a good outcome looks like, right? We have not created any methods of accountability. We don't say, or very few companies have those, um, where they say, oh, well, if you don't meet this diversity goal, this thing will happen. That just doesn't happen. There's no accountability for what we're trying to do. Um, we're not measuring and reporting on indicators of inclusion, like retentions, like promotions, like pay equity. We're just reporting on diversity, who is in the building, but not saying how they're doing when they get there. And we're not monitoring across all intersections. We are only right now, except for, I think recently, uh, Slack, where I used to work, um, released their diversity report, which included uh, people with disabilities, um, Mostly, we're just tracking gender and race. And there are very many other sections or intersections that we should be uh, tracking along. We have too much reliance on unconscious bias as a cure-all. Every time this discussion comes up, people say, oh, we have unconscious bias training. We're done. Fini. Um, and that's just the unconscious bias training, I say, is probably the pre-K of diversity and inclusion training. Um, companies have not responded well to reports of harassment, right? We've seen what happened recently with Susan Fowler when she, you know, wrote her thing about Uber. And she said, yeah, I told everybody I was supposed to tell at Uber. I did everything I was supposed to do, and still nothing happened. And so people have to basically publicize what's going on instead of companies showing up and doing the right thing to begin with.